I your big man. Yes you, fake historian. You remember 1975? No. You seriously don't remember Israeli jets hitting Palestinian sites in Lebanon raids? What comic book you're from? It was everywhere in the news? You forgot or something? That's funny. I swear you said you lived there a year or two after? Did no one tell you what happened? Did you oversleep or something? Anyway, on December 3, 1975 Lebanon together with Syria and Palestine informed the United Nations that an act of aggression has been committed by Israel against Lebanon and the Palestinians. Lebanon fully agreed with the description given by Syria and Palestine of the pirate acts of Israel, which has flagrantly violated the territorial integrity of Lebanon and has perpetrated barbarous air raids against a number of settlements in that Arab state, and against the Palestinian camps on that territory. There were victims among the civilian population. Hundreds of peaceful inhabitants have been injured or killed, especially women, elderly and children. A number of dwellings and buildings were destroyed. Even the American press was obliged to recognize that the greatest number of victims, as a result of those barbarous Israeli attacks, were the civilian population. The New York Times reported that 30 Israeli warplanes, believed to be phantoms and skyhawks, struck the camps and nearby villages, swinging in from the sea shortly after 10 a.m. on December 2, 1975. Israeli jets attacked Palestinian camps in northern and southern Lebanon, inflicting the heaviest reported death toll in such raids in a year and a half till that date bombing and strafing for an hour.